Hello and thank you for joining The Mortgage Mum. Um, I'm here today to talk to you about shared ownership schemes and you'll notice in my videos recently that there's a bit of a theme occurring. I'm trying to really help those of you who are struggling to get on the property ladder feel educated so that you know the different options that are available to you and there are so many. So we're just getting started and I will continue to deliver some information to you on other schemes that are happening that could potentially be the right scheme for you. Today I'm talking about shared ownership. So shared ownership mortgages are for those of you who have low income households um, who want to get on the property ladder. You need to be a first time buyer or a previous homeowner and you need to have good credit. So we're looking for people who are not in mortgage or rent arrears and have a good credit report. Um, you basically buy a share of a property and you pay rent on the remaining portion to the housing scheme provider. So you can buy 25% share all the way up to 75% and eventually you can staircase your way up to 100% so that you fully own the property and we'll work with you to try and get you there so that um, you know exactly what you need to be earning and doing to try and hit your target of owning the property in full. But it's really good for those of you who just simply cannot afford the mortgages that you need to get the type of properties that you need, the size of the property that you're looking for. So it can be a really good way of getting you your family home that you need, getting the space that you guys need for your children and for yourselves um, when you can't afford it. Um, and you can work your way up as you can afford more and more, you can buy more and more shares of the property and that's called staircasing. Um, you can have as little as 5% deposit, so sometimes um, you don't need to have saved a lot of money to get the type of property that you need. And um, we are still looking at affordability, but only affordability on your share of the mortgage, which can really help you. Um, you pay rent on the remaining and you can also end up paying service charge or a contribution to ground rent depending on the type of property that you're after. And it has to be on shared ownership properties. So there's certain people, there's like share to buy um, and help to buy that you can have a look and they will direct you to properties that are specifically for shared ownership because it has to be certain properties, you can't do it on any property that's on the market. I think that's the main things you need to know. Um, the best thing to do is to speak to a broker so that we can look at your individual situation. Um, but if you are struggling to borrow what you need and you just feel like there's no hope, you're never gonna be able to buy a property, then maybe consider a shared ownership because it's a really good balance between renting and owning a property and means that you're working towards it rather than just renting and feeling like there's no hope of you ever having your own property yourselves. Um, if you want to know more, then my email is sarah at themortgagemum.co.uk and our website is www.themortgagemum.co.uk and we have an inquiry form um, and obviously there's quite a few of us now so if you want to deal with anyone specifically having watched our videos then you can put that in the inquiry form too and we'll do our best to accommodate. Otherwise, more schemes coming soon. Thank you.